Hey, this is Tyler Rustin with Cisco Meraki, and today I'm going to show you how you can troubleshoot using Meraki technology. So let's say we get a support call from Jackie Rowe. She's having a hard time connecting to the network. I can come in here and I can search the name of her client, and we found her MacBook right here. I can click on that, and here I can get some really interesting information about her device. I can see the location of the device. I can see the access point that she's connected to. I can see the applications that she's running, so it looks like she did a very large um, something very large on Dropbox. And I can even see that she's enrolled in our systems manager. If I wanted to stop that Dropbox um, traffic from passing, I could block her device. I could apply a group policy. But let's say she's having trouble connecting to the network. Directly from this page, I can click on the access point that she's connected to. And so I can actually follow the, the problem up into the access point. And here we can see how many clients are connected to that AP. We can ping those clients. So let's go ahead and expand this list out. We can see Jackie Rose MacBook right here. We can see the signal strength. We can then see the live uplink traffic that's passing through that access point. And that's just loading right now. So while that loads, I'll show you, we have these tools that allow you to blink the LEDs, check the throughput. We can run a trace route. Um, and we even have a reboot button that's not available to me as a sales executive, but would be available to you. So if we go back to the summary, here we can see the live traffic that's passing through that access point. Now let's say we determine that the problem isn't at the access point level. We can actually see the switch and the switch port that this access point is connected to. So let's jump directly into that Meraki switch port. And from here, we have a lot of tools as well. We can see the ports that are being used on the switch. We can see the connectivity. And then if we wanted to, we can do things like run a packet capture or run a cable test. Now, I'm located in San Francisco. This network is in London. But even from San Francisco, working on the London network, I can see the cable length. I can see that everything is going OK. And you can continue to follow this all the way through your network, all the way up to the firewall. And so that's troubleshooting with Cisco Meraki. We want to make it super easy for you. If you have any questions, let me know.